Sometimes we don't know what can happen in the world. Disaster have no date or time. 34 years ago, the world witnessed a disaster of red magnitude. On April 25 and 26, 1986, the world's nuclear accident story was in northern Ukraine when a raptor at the nuclear power plant exploded and burned. People used to lie quiet without fear of radiation caused by disaster. The high levels of radiation not only affect people, it also affects natural that was close to the nuclear plant. Too many trees die from contamination portals in the air and too many trees survive but they wear change their color to brown. It's currently called the Red Forest. Some animals that used to be nerved with died from radiation. Other animals that could survive but suffer genetic mutation. Too many species of animals such as wild boars, wolves, bears, and bisons. We are able to increase their population. Riyadh was the town most affected. The people who used to live their life all day, their teens, on their homes. You cannot stay more than one hour in this place because everything is radioactive. After the Chernobyl disaster, the companies have street security protocols. They must teach the workers the protocols, theory, and practice. Each workplace must have simulators in different rooms where it is more risk. These simulators could prevent disasters warning when something is wrong. The world is changing. We need better care for the environment. Many countries don't have a nuclear plants. They have other alternatives such as in renewable energy hydraulic, winds, and others. This school could avoid disaster and that we won't witness that experience again as in Chernobyl. Last week, we had interviews with the survivors of disaster. They were talking their experience. People remember this disaster. They were feeling fear and anguish. This caused a lot of damage, like a fear that the babies born in this place would have diseases, in general defects, and mental retardation. In the place where it happened, it is no longer the same because it has high pollution and radiation. People must always have masks. Good morning. Today we are in a video call be soon with one of the people who faced this great Chernobyl tragedy, for which we will ask some questions. How was the place used to be before? What was the city like before the disaster? What was your life like before this incident? In the past, the city was uh, big and safe. As low, it was a beautiful and had too many parts and shop is The family of the nuclear 
plan worked in a lift in the city before the day of the accident. My father was uh, working at the nuclear plant. And today, Pripyat is a god's, uh, god's town in North Ukraine, but in the past, the city was a very, full, very beautiful. My life before the, the accident was uh, normal. I was a uh, machine. Um, I lived with my father and my mother, but my father day, the day of the nuclear plants accident. I would like to know what you were doing at the time when this disaster occurred. I remember studying with my mom when I heard the big bang. My mother was uh, very scared. And I talked on the TV and was watching the news. On the news, my mother heard about the explosion at the nuclear plant and she was uh, crying. Later, my mother and I had to leave the city by order of the authority. We, we leave our home behind. The next day, my mother and I learned of my father's death at the nuclear plant. How did the authorities behave when incident happened? Sometime after the accident, all, all the military fight first as it to the plan were all right on the on third way to the control they deserve. The behavior of the fighters was heroic during the first house of the accident of the accident as it prevents the fire from Spain to the rest of the plan. For these reasons, it can be said that the attitude of the people in the face of the cat catastrophe that occurred was timely. Now we meet another of the people who was a victim of this disaster. We will ask him how did he deal with this catastrophe and how did they evacuate the site? Hi, uh, well, my experience um, in the accident that night, uh, I was cooking the dinner and my husband, who was a firefighter, uh, received a call major emergency about a fire at the nuclear power plant. And uh, when he returned home, he told me that there was an explosion in one of the reactors. The workers who used to work to, at the reactor were in, injured, and two workers who were there, the reactor, uh, had died. And then, time after, my husband got sick, and um, many people were dying of cancer after the accident. How do you feel at this moment? Um, I feel so bad. Um, um, people were dying. Um, my husband we, was sick. Um, I feel I felt fair and good. This caused a lot of damage, like uh, fair. And they uh, make a lot of disaster and committed defect and mental retardation to the people. Thanks, you very much for your time. 
and the information that you have just give us. I am sorry uh, for the love of people and the match that this cause. We hope that this type of disaster does not happen again. We have to be prepared, disaster like this can still happen. Thank you, bye. bye. Thank you, bye.